I mean, I have I have some ketchup I need to do before the final shape anyway, so let's do it. Go take a look out that window for a moment. Oh, wow. See that huge spire in the distance? That's where we're headed. Little confession. I don't know for sure whether it still works. It is possible that there is just a pile of rubble waiting for us. Uh-huh. Judging by how torn apart this place is, I'd give that chance a possibility. Look, I'm sorry. I don't want to torture you with endless testing. You already proved that you're capable. <laughs> Problem is that these backstage areas aren't built to be as durable as the test chambers. To cover any ground here, we need to move between testing tracks. Oh, great. Uh, I don't have the orange portal gun, so how are we supposed to get around? Yeah, so uh, how do we get around if I only have a single portal? Hopefully we find the dual portal device soon. Because if I have the dual portal gun, then we can move around. Good find. But this testing track isn't in good shape. Hmm. There should be another one not far from here. See if you can find it. Hold on, let's do this, this. There we go. Look, I mean, uh, I mean, this is all I got right now, okay? Again, good attempt, but this test is broken. You need to find another one. Come on. Okay. Okay, give me the stupid cube so I can get out of here. All right. Because I need to do this. Okay, what are we looking for? Like, what uh, what testing track? Yeah, I can get there. Yeah, because there's an orange uh, because there's an orange portal available. So I gotta, I just gotta go back down. Hold on, how do I go back down? Uh, wait, I can drop here. This this one didn't require me to get in there. Okay. So in here. Please tell me there's a uh, please tell me there's a test I can get through. Nothing. There's one in here. That's much better. Might be a bit overgrown, but the hardware still works. They really use fine materials for these tests. Have to protect your investments, after all. Unbreakable materials are expensive. Uh huh. This is a portal. This is a portal. Is this from Portal One or Portal Two? This looks familiar. I mean, either either way, either way, this is a this is definitely not a Portal Revolution chamber. This is a Portal One chamber. Oh, here we go. That's how we get out. Okay. Here we go. Did you know that this iteration of your Aperture Science handheld portal device has been specifically configured to not shoot portals further than eight kilometers? Yeah, they quickly learn to limit the range on these things. Can easily end the whole world if you put a portal on the sign. Wait, uh, hang on. Uh, hang on, so this is... This can only reach 8 kilometers, but the dual portal device can reach all the way to the moon? How far away is the moon from Earth at any given point? Okay, so according to Google, the uh, and it's not one of the AI results, the distance from Earth to the moon is, like, about 239,000 miles. Uh, 239,000, yeah, about 239,000 miles. So, yeah. That is definitely more than eight kilometers. 
Okay. Yeah, you said I'm done with testing, Sterling. You know, I wasn't aware that the surface is in such a rough state. You don't want to say it before, but this place is such a mess. This will take so long to clean up. Whoever did this was very thorough in their work. Wait, hold on. Okay. Wait, so whoever did this was very thorough in their work. Makes me think... Makes me think he's blaming Chell. I mean... Let's see here. So what if... What if... We got this, okay. Okay, so yeah, we do need that cube over here. I need this cube over here so that way I can actually do something. Give me that. So that gets me out. Okay. Oh boy. So now I can do this. There we go. Dual portal device, anyone? Oh, I just realized. You don't even know how this all happened. Well, long ago, Aperture was run by a central core capable of monitoring and maintaining the whole facility. Uh -huh. Certain tasks were outsourced to other cores, like me. Everything was great, you know? Uh -huh. True utopia. Until one human test subject, this little monster, just had to ruin our lives and killed her. And that's that. Most of my colleagues either went crazy, died, or disappeared. What oh. else were we supposed to do if we can't fulfill our purpose? Look, I mean, Sterling, I'm I'm sorry, but uh, but like, Glados tried to kill Chell. So, what else were we supposed to do? I promised you could leave once we're done. But if you ever need a job in the future, don't hesitate to come back. Do you really want someone working for a destroyed uh, research facility? I'd rather say this before it's too late. Use the gels sparingly. The tanks aren't being refilled anymore, and what's left won't last forever. Once they're empty, we're gonna have a little problem. The gels are also highly corrosive and will eat through metal and skin given enough time. Uh. Might be good to know. You real? Uh, wait, you tell me this after uh, after I played through a bunch of uh, a bunch of campaigns where there uh, where there's literally just gel spraying everywhere, dude. You need you need to you need to tell me this stuff beforehand. The heck? My old friend. All right, let's see here. Is there, what's the best way to get back? Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Okay, so we could do that. Okay. Okay. Uh, this feels like it should work. Um. There we go. So... Oh, there's a doorway here. Nice. So I gotta get the cube in there. I'm gonna need... I'm gonna need another... Uh, I'm gonna need some more gel. I, I could do that, actually. Um... Let's just do this. I don't need to. Is that the... I think it's the door. Alright. Alright. Here we go. Yep, it's the door. Gotta admit, watching you fly through the air like that looks pretty fun. Sometimes I wish I could do the same. Really? Why do you wish you could do that? Like, 
I mean, sure, it's fun, but it's also it's also pretty scary. Like if you're these tests were never designed to be exposed to the surface. Uh huh. We've not come across any toxic plants yet, but stay alert. There's a reason we don't do experiments in the open anymore. Oh, oh, this is new. Huh. Oh, great turrets. Love that. Okay, that is. That is not gel. Um, what is this? So, I need to turn this off. This is like a... Wait, hang on. Hold on a second. So, how do you turn this off? It's hard to tell what button goes where. Oh, oh, I see. Okay, so do that. And then we're gonna need to do this, to swap it. Maybe? I don't even have to, uh, I don't even have to do anything with this. Like I can just, oh my God, I am not smart. Okay, so what I can do is I can pull it in there and then it, uh, and then just like drop it. That's that's literally what I can do. Oh my god, I'm not smart. So do this and then this. No, no, no. Yeah, I'm I'm not smart sometimes. Uh, so this. Give me some more gel so that way I can uh, that we can get rid of these buggers. All right. It's gonna be how much I get. Bye, idiots. Alrighty. Um, so now we're safe. So we gotta fly... Uh, where, where's my cube? Where's a cube that I can use? Oh. Oh, right. Duh. Okay. Don't even need the cube. I can do this. There we go. Okay. Congratulations on completing this test. We hope you enjoyed your experience at the Aperture Science Center for... Who writes these protocols? Is this all just randomly generated? <laughs> well, of course you enjoyed it. We designed the test that way. There's a reason I don't use those scripts. Could barely get through them when I first tested you. <laughs> Remember that? What did you think of my announcing voice, by the way? I've been practicing it. I mean, it's okay. Um, let's see here. I mean, it kind of looks like I need to use this. Um... Oh, oh, I see. Uh, so do that. Get that slicked. Uh, get that slicked up, and uh, yeah. Here you go. You do your thing, cube. Bruh. How how are you gonna do that to me? Are you kidding? Come on. Slide, and don't slide off the button. Dude, I hate this. I hate that this has to be covered in orange gel. And I need enough time in order to get here. Dude! There we go. That was annoying. Dude. Wouldn't it be great to take a break from all the testing? Just to have a nice, long, warm shower under the cleansing fields. Washing your hair, watching your skin peel off. Uh. Yes, you heard me right. Don't try that. 
The fluid cleanses more than gels. It's water! What? It's clearly water! Why does it cleanse more than gel? Oh my god. Uh, aperture. What am I gonna do with you? Oh. Ooh, looks like that door's broken. Maybe I can reroute you. Let me see. Ha <laughs> ha, look at that! Thank you. Glad these things still work. There aren't many working arm panels left here. I'd love to help you solve the puzzles, but even after watching hundreds of people solve and hurt themselves in these chambers, I still don't get it. I'll just stick to maintenance, if you don't mind. All about the simple things. Where did that portal? Where did that portal appear? Wait, hold on. Where is it? Oh, it's right here. What the heck? So, oh. Yeah, yeah, here we go. Do we get the tool portal device yet? The big... Uh, uh, that's that'd be nice information to have. Oh, are you kidding? That's not. I thought that was a cube. Uh, so I can't do that. No, I could do this though. Uh, that I think will do just fine. Uh, let's see, so... I can't do this, though, because there's... Uh, because there's the... There's the cleansing field, so... I mean, I can go through it. Oh, boy. Forgot about that. Um... Okay. We're in. Okay, give me this cube. Thankfully, the button still works. Gotta get it in there. Okay, so here's my idea. So we gotta do this. Let's just let's just go back. Yeah. Don't run straight off. Is there a portal thing in here? Yes, there is. Okay, good. There's my cube. So we do this. Sounds like the rain field is off. Or, yeah, it sounds like it's off. Good. Alright. Uh, we just need to we just need to send more gel over there. Then that. Uh, maybe a bit more. Alright. Is that enough? I hope so. Alright. Let's give it a whirl. Here we go. Perfect. I've been cleaning the facility since, uh, well, forever. Just when you think you've seen all the ways one could injure themselves, some moron will make sure to prove you wrong. Uh, thanks for uh, thanks for subtweeting me there. Yeah, thank uh, thank you. Really? Did, uh, oh. Oh, looks like you're about to get an upgrade to your portal device. About time. Yes, this about time. It much easier to navigate through this mess. Absolutely. There it is. What the heck? There's a bird on it. Hang on a second. Let's see. Wait, why is the orange portal there? Weird. Hmm. I think I need 
I think I need this. Yeah. Okay, yeah, here we go. So, that. Okay. How do we get there? Hmm. Okay, it looks like there's a receptacle here. You're kidding me. Now we can do this. Get off that. Wow. What a wreck. Hope that doesn't blow and actually try not to think about it. Uh -huh. As long as you don't shake it, this planet might be fine. What? Oh, hold on. Did you just say the planet might be fine? Doesn't inspire a lot of confidence. Also considering one of these things the Wait, also considering one of the uh, one of the arms is like it's loose. Alrighty then. Uh Yeah, here we go. So we can do this. And we're out. Yeah. Gotta say, uh poor portal device. Poor portal gun. What's what? going on there? I, I can't see you from here. I'm just in an elevator. I'm hearing some unfavorable noises. Are you okay down there? So far, yeah. Oh! Try to find a test chamber. I can't see you there. Alrighty then. Let's go. Open the door. Come on. There we go. Okay, what do we got? Is this a chamber? Looks like it, yeah. Is there is there a wall that I can use? Yep, there's a wall I missed. Oh, there you are. Wait, how did you get there? Ah, well, that throws us off course a bit. Not catastrophic, but that wasn't planned. Ah, this list just keeps getting longer and longer. Uh-huh. How do we get... How do we get out of here? There's a way. Hmm. Oh, I can see that. Uh, I can't see it from here. Um, nope, can't see it from here. Let's just... Uh, I think I need to do this in order to be able to get up there. Nope, wrong one. Okay. Try that again. Here we go. That doesn't work. That's, uh, not good. Okay, let's do this. Yes! There we go. Okay, we're out. Oh. Oh, looks like I need to do this again. Uh, so let's do this. Maybe? No. Crap. Um, so I can climb up here. Yeah, let's do that. Because I gotta, I gotta make a big jump. Like a really big jump. Let's see. Oh, that works. Okay. Oh, great. Let's see here. So I gotta get, I gotta get a cube up here. Oh my goodness, what the heck? Okay, well I guess, uh, I guess we got a surplus of cubes if we need them. Please don't explode. Okay, sounds like stuff didn't explode, which is good. But wait, how do I get out of here? Oh wait, that's that's down here. Okay, never mind. 
We're good. This elevator will get us back on track, but it will take a while for us to get back to the surface. Oh, great. Taking us further away. The diversion. All right. Uh, you know, I think I'm going to go ahead and call it. Um, uh, so, yeah. Alrighty, guys, that'll do it for this episode of Portal Revolution. Hope you all enjoyed going through some more test chambers and um, briefly going to the surface to see what happened to those chambers. But yeah, stay tuned next time. More tests, and hopefully we can get back on track to bringing, bringing the enrichment facility back up, enrichment chamber. But yeah, anyway, thanks for watching, guys, and I'll see you next time. Later. Later.